Good morning guys. It is day one of a two day. It is super early. Um, right now it's about 5.20 in the morning and I've been up since 2.30 because I commuted in last night from Atlanta to Newark. Um, got in around like 10, almost 11 o'clock. Yeah, I said almost 11 o'clock and then I had to get up and take the 3.30 a.m. shuttle from Newark to LaGuardia because that was the earliest shuttle. Um, it's where I make it in time for my 5 a.m. check-in. You guys are probably wondering why didn't you just fly straight to LaGuardia? Well, because by the time I realized that I had tripped, um, I was not gonna make a flight to LaGuardia, so that was that. So I had to sacrifice my sleep um, to go ahead and uh, make it to work. Yeah, so anyway, today is gonna be a long day. Um, it's technically only like an 11 hour work day, but we have four flights today. So you're currently in LaGuardia. Uh, we're at LaGuardia Houston and then Houston, Austin. Austin back to Houston, Houston back to Austin. Yeah. I'm trying to mentally prepare myself for that. You know, although the flight's not very long, I'm just, for the days, it just like, why? Like, why is that a thing? Anywho, hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are happy and healthy. Um, I am doing great. I woke up this morning, so I'm blessed. So, uh, yeah, it's gonna be a good day. I am working in the back today. Um, I am the galley person. This is me, all of me, all of me. And so I will be doing that for the rest of the trip. And then, um, let's see, we're over in Austin. I think it's like 14 hours, I think. Don't quote me. And then we work. I believe back to Houston tomorrow. Then Houston back to LaGuardia, and then we get in right before 1 p.m. I guess we just go home. This girl. Okay. Anyway. Yeah. So um, I think I'm a little bit delirious because, uh, you know, I didn't sleep very long last night. But you know, we don't just we don't work with it. Anywho, um, if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Since you're already here, you know, I'll just say, hope you like the video. And I'm gonna go ahead and set up my galley, and um, I will see you guys probably when we get to Houston or whenever we get to Austin. It was one of however many times today, okay? But I'll let you guys see me set up my galley, okay? All right, see you soon. what's up guys it is a new day this is day two yesterday was absolutely insane okay i'm just gonna start off by saying that um the last time you guys saw me i was setting up my galley in LaGuardia, and i said i see you guys when we got to houston so let's recap shall we Anywho, um, good morning, because right now it is like around, let's see, it's 4.40. Um, this trip is just crazy. Let me just start by saying that, okay? So it's 4.40 in the morning. As you guys can see, I am not dressed for work, okay? My check-in is 5 a.m. technically, but we'll get to that in a minute. So anyway, yesterday, um, the last time you guys saw me, um, I was going to Houston. Um, that flight was super easy. You know no problem at all we it was a three-hour flight um, we got to Houston and the flight was just a little bit delayed coming in that we were taking to Austin so we just had to wait a little bit for that so get on the plane take a 29 minute flight from Houston to Austin no problem we drop them off load them up go right back to Houston uh, about a 30 minute flight there 34 minute flight there no problem now that's three flights right there right guys we had a four Flight, a four leg day okay so we get back to Houston and we're you know we're getting ready for our last flight now at this point 
I'm dog tired. My buddy in the back, he's dog tired because we both had to wake up at 2.30 to make it to LaGuardia on time. So anywho, um, we took a mini break. We're like taking a mini nap. The captain comes on board and he's like, yeah, guys. He's like, there's something wrong with the wheel. What? Now, mind you, landing felt a little bumpy the both, both times they already had to come back to Houston because, let me see, I'm sorry. So we took off landing in Austin and came back landing in Houston. So both times the landing felt a little like bumpy, you know, and we had the same plane. So they're like, yeah, they gotta take care of the wheel or whatever. All right, no problem. So <laughs> they take care of the wheel, um, maintenance fixes that, but we had to get out the plane for them to do that. We go get food, come back, cool. So we go ahead and load them up and for some reason, it just felt like it took forever to leave. Okay, so another 29 minute flight. Get up in the air, go back down, okay? We just did water service, by the way. So there was nothing to set up in my galley, you know? Um, and by the way, I apologize because I was just so tired, you guys. And I know I've been saying that. It's just, I've been having like, every time I work, I've been having long days and short layovers. Like, it's just been like, go, go, go. So, Whew, I was just exhausted yesterday. So, um, anywho, yeah. So we we land back in um, Austin. Take off from Houston, land in Austin, and we get here. And the jet bridge, they can't get the jet bridge set up. So at this point, it's just like, okay, this flight just keeps getting longer and longer for no reason. Which should have been like a 29 minute flight. It's turning into like an hour and a half almost. It seems. <sighs> Cause we took off late or whatever and mind you our layover was already at 12 hours exactly so then the passengers are up you know they didn't put their bags in the aisle and the captain comes on hey you guys we need you guys to take your seats again because we got to get towed to another gate because they can't get the jet, jet bridge to work so people were like oh my god how is it? it's a 30 minute flight and, da -da 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 -da. and i'm just like can we please get off this plane please so ready <laughs> to get off this plane Anywho, we finally make it to Austin. The crew and I, um, we get some really good barbecue at the airport, come to our rooms, and we're just done. Because we were like, okay, we didn't get to our hotel until 5 p.m. and our check-in was at 5 a.m. again, right? Fast forward to today. Hope y'all like that. <laughs> just kidding. I'll probably insert something. Anyway, so I got my little like seven hours of sleep, you know, I didn't got up. I'm like, okay, look, I'm ready to do this because it's supposed to be one quick flight back to Houston and then Houston LaGuardia and your girl is done. I'm done, done, done for the weekend. I'm off. Okay. Uh -uh, nope. So as you guys can see, my eyebrows are like partially done. Okay. Because your girl had got up. I had washed my face, brushed my teeth, rinsed. I had taken a shower. I was dressed. And I began my eyebrows. Everything was packed up. Guess who gets a phone call from scheduling? This girl. This girl right here. Yeah, I get a call from scheduling. When I'm like about to walk out the door in like less than 20 minutes. Hey, uh, your, your period's been uh, modified. Your check-in's now at 10 o'clock. Y'all. Right now it's 4.44. They called at, let's see, 4.19 and told me my check-in was at 10 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> After I've been up, I've now been up, um, let's see, an hour and 15 minutes, cause I got up at 3.30 so I wouldn't be late for the show. So, I didn't put my gym clothes on. I'm about to just go work out now. Um, before I do that, um, I will bring you guys with me while I work out. Don't judge me. Um, just because this vlog, I mean, it's like, yeah. And I will vlog the rest of the day, okay? Okay, so y'all y'all bear with me here, okay? <laughs> Anywho, um, let me show you guys the room really quick and then um, we'll go work out and then come back and probably take a nap. And like, you know, yeah, and do this all over again. Okay, all right, see y'all in a minute. All right, guys, so I really enjoyed this room. We'll start with the bathroom here, shower. As y'all can see, my makeup was already ready to go. We were ready to go, y'all. Okay, and then come out here. You have a nice little sitting area. I love when I have this. 
we did have two beds i didn't have my king but you know what they were comfortable so i'll take it a nice tv no it didn't have netflix or hulu but i'll take it i just watched the news all night which was kind of depressing and then we did have a fridge um i didn't open it up it might be cold i don't really know come over here we have a little you know closet area and then let's see there was no view it's also really dark out still not light. anyway we'll get to that later so yeah this is the room uh -oh. and um yeah we're about to go work out now okay let's go all right so i need to get my phone and my airpods and my room key because um i don't know they might be trying to try me and not know that we're not checking on so later my room key better still work i hope and like this video and subscribe if you haven't already so you can become a part of the fly fam <laughs> let me know if y'all like it or not because i don't know i'm still working around with it or we can call it the crew what do y'all want to call it you know call our little our little family here let me know in the comments below okay and we still gotta find this gym just the trip like delays it's a delayed trip i don't know so we're currently sitting here in austin um waiting for our plane to get here from san antonio it's finally taxi to the runway and although our check-in was still 1005 that plane doesn't get until 11 11. so we're gonna be sitting here until it gets here and uh that's that yeah also, by the way, all the food in Austin is just good. Like, everything I've had here is just amazing. Y'all know. Well, maybe you don't know this, but I'm a huge foodie. I love food. Yeah. So, anyway. Um, when the plane gets here, I will talk to you guys. So, see y'all in a bit. Okay guys, so we're finally on the plane. Um, they came in from San Antonio. The plane came in completely empty. <laughs> so literally it came up to the gate and we're about to start boarding. And it's gonna be a 29 minute flight. So it means it's just a water service. And yeah, this is crazy. You got dessert. 
<laughs> Finally. Oh my god, it was free. Free 99. So later there, I'll come back up and then I'll see you Okay guys, so this is one of my crew members because I always I tell you guys I don't like asking people to be in the videos, but if they say something then yes. So this is Victoria or Raven Rizzo's. <laughs> I said I wanted to be in one of her little videos real quick. <laughs> so yes guys. Subscribe to Tari. Yes. <laughs> and help her channel grow, so support her. <laughs> oh, thank you! Thank you guys. So, she wanted to say hi, so she also has a channel. She has a channel, I guys. Used to. She used to have a channel, I'm sorry. So she up. starts it up again then. <laughs> Listen, you saw her here again first, again. <laughs> okay guys, so the flight is about 30 minutes. There's literally maybe 15 people back here. No lie. Like, that is it. That's all we have. Yeah. Like, like nobody was playing. So um, we just went through Gable Snacks. So they're like happy. And then um, we're going to do like a really quick drink service. To get here. We're just going to go through and take their order or whatever. Let's see. I don't know. Well, we'll see. Okay, so see you guys when we get to Houston. Bye. It's me again. And I like to say that I'm just like, I'm so happy because I was able to, you know, go straight home instead of going to LaGuardia, but no. So, um, we finally worked the flight, as you guys saw, you know, we got the flight or whatever, or it's from Austin to Houston, got to Houston, and I planned on what's called faking my deadhead. Um, because we were, we were scheduled to deadhead back to LaGuardia, which means we fly as regular passengers. Well, um, I called scheduling to see if I could do that. You know, not take the deadhead and just go straight home to Atlanta. And I was told no because there's weather. And I'm not going to speak it into existence right now, but they said no. <laughs> so um, I'm sitting here waiting to see what's going to happen. Um, if I'm going to just be able to go straight home. And that's kind of just what's going on nothing too major um the flight from austin was super super easy like y'all saw how many people were on the flight nobody so we did actually offer everybody like drinks we didn't pull out the cart physically but we did ask them you know if they wanted anything special besides water they did get some snacks so they were happy and um yeah it's just a waiting game so right now it is 108 the plane that's supposed to go to LaGuardia boards at 152 supposedly and um yeah so also by the time you guys see this um it will be like in the future but right now um new orleans is being impacted by floods and a lot of rain so um i'm just gonna keep new orleans in my prayers because i i mean i remember what happened with hurricane katrina and i can imagine anything close to happening again you know so i'm just gonna pray for them i am praying for them that they are safe if anybody who is in new orleans is watching this i'm praying for you um i'm praying that you and your family are protected and that you are okay in the name of jesus and that you are all covered because i can only imagine how insane that must be you know how stressful that situation must be how scary it must be so just wanted to you know put that out there Anywho, uh, I'm gonna sit here and keep waiting for whatever's gonna happen next. And uh, I'll let you guys know what happens. So I'm hoping, I'm just hoping I just get those straight home because I don't even wanna think about what's after that. If I, you know, if I can't go straight home, I don't even think about it. So, yeah. So, yeah, I'll talk to you guys soon. Okay. TTY. Oh, wait, no. So they had to take fuel off the plane to even accommodate the passengers that were uh, regular, which means they paid for the flights and the standbys could not get on. 
except for like a coast. So we had a lady for another flight. It was at 5:49. Um, it's currently 4:27. So um, I just I don't even care. It's time the flight leaves tonight. Why don't I just get home today? So um, yeah, I'm gonna sit here and edit a video for you guys because I know that I have been like. Like, I know I'm so sorry. Y'all can, you know, y'all can, can be upset with me. You know, I'll take it because I have this life. But I'm just doing my best to try to get a video to this every Sunday, okay? So, um, I'm gonna go ahead and start editing the video that I'm working on now and then edit some more videos so that way um, I have a video for you guys every week and it's all about time management. So, working on it. So I'm gonna let you guys know whenever I get a seat or gonna make it cool. So I'll see you guys then. Bye. Hey guys, me again. So um, still currently at Houston's airport, and um, obviously I still didn't get a flight. So <laughs> the right time to charm right now is 6:47. Okay. So right now it's 6.47 or 6.48 and um, I'm waiting for the flight, um, the last flight on Delta. I'm supposed to leave at 6.51 I believe. Um, so we still have like an hour and the gate is just gonna sure get on because I really don't want to pay for a flight and I really don't want to sleep at the airport and I've been up since uh, 3 a.m. originally. So, or 3.30 originally. So. I'm pretty tired and um, yeah, I did get some pizza from a place called Blaze Pizza, so I'll show you guys that. Pizza and I'm going to devour, devour it. Eat it up, I know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Um, so I want to see you guys help me when we get on the plane. Right, it's time to try them, right? But at first you don't see that you're still gonna try again. That's on the theme of today. Whew. So um, anyway, yeah, so I'll see y'all hopefully when we get on the plane or get to Atlanta. Ow. Okay, until then. What is up you guys? So I clearly made it home. Um it is now about Let's see. It's 12.15 a.m. And I'm sitting in my car because as you guys can see, it's raining. So I'm waiting for it to die down just a little bit before I get all my stuff out of the car. Um, anyway, so yeah, I did finally get my last flight from Houston on Delta. Thank God. <laughs> and um, I had a good seat. Um, you know, it was great. Um, the only thing was that I had people like directly behind me who they like they were talking so loud the entire flight even with my airpods in trying to like listen to music i could hear them so you know i just feel like people should be a little bit more considerate of the people that surround them um you know that's just a thought <laughs> but hey what am i talking about who am i anyway um so yeah it's just been an extremely long day yesterday was an extremely long day um i wish that i had like checked my schedule earlier um instead of scheduling calling me so that way I could have slept in a little bit longer versus like you know interrupting my sleep but on a positive note I was able to work out so we're not gonna even we're not even gonna go there anyway my saying for this trip is if at first you don't succeed dust yourself off and try again and who said that the best baby girl aka Aliyah just saying so anyway <laughs> I'm starting to rant because I'm extremely um sleep deprived I feel at this point I've been up almost 24 hours now it feels besides my one little hour um, nap that I took you know before I checked in um, as you guys can see commuting is another job if you haven't already watched my um, what my commute is like video make sure you go ahead and watch that I'll try to link it um, somewhere or I'll link it below um, I'll try to do one or the other and um i hope you guys enjoyed this video i want to send a special thank you to everyone who has subscribed who has liked who has shared who has commented who continues to do those things for me i really appreciate it i do want my channel to grow um you know and 
any little bit helps. Um, on my part, I just need to be more consistent with uploading, and I'm trying, I really am trying, you guys. I, I really am trying. So please bear with me. <laughs> um, anyway, I guess that's all I really had to say. Um, I love you guys, I love you guys, I love you guys. I cannot say that enough. And I cannot wait to see you guys in my next video. I'm going to try to go ahead and run in the house because it is slacking up just a little bit. So anyway, like I said, um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, and I will see you guys in my next one. Okay, bye for now. Bye. <laughs>